So as you can see, I'm a snail. No, not that one. This one. But you're probably asking yourself, Fry Guy, why are you a snail? Well, if you have been on TikTok at all lately, you have heard about the immortal snail riddle. If you haven't, let me fill you in. Basically, there's this hypothetical question going around TikTok, which is, would you become immortal at the cost of there being a snail that is chasing you around the world 24 seven? And if it touches you, you die. The snail is also immortal and also always knows where you are. Now I have fallen in love with this hypothetical question and I have now decided to turn it into a Minecraft game. So, for the next 100 days, my friend and I are both immortal. And my goal as a snail is to simply touch him within that time. If I can do that, he will die and I will win the game. However, I am extremely slow. So catching my friend is not going to be easy. As you can see, I'm a giant snail and I have slowness too and I'm invincible, just like it says. And over there is Unicorn, my friend, who uh, also is invincible, but he's not a snail and he's not slow and he's normal speed. He has to survive 100 days not getting caught by this giant snail. And my goal is to obviously catch him. When I count down from three, the game officially begins. In three, two, one, go! Now, you're gonna notice in my inventory, I start off with a compass that automatically tracks him. I automatically know where he is. He does not know where I am, so it is different. And I also have a sword, but this sword can only be used in trying to attack Unicorn, hence the name Unicorn Killer. I cannot use it on mobs. That is cheating, and I'm not allowed to do it. So, okay, he's getting far away fast. All right, I can see the snail in the distance. <laughs> That's terrifying. <laughs> Oh boy, you know, it's nice being on the hunted side for once. Okay, I'm gonna quickly cut down a tree here. Can. Now, I have 100 days to catch him. We are on day zero. I'm not worried about it. Okay, I can get him. Here we go. Does he see me coming in? Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm gonna win already. Oh my god. I'm gonna... No! I'll be, um, I'll be sure not to let Ryan nearby to the best of my ability. Ooh. Ooh, he's close. He saw me. He saw me. Come on. Go. Go. We gotta get him. <laughs> We're such a big snail. Oh, God. And I get glitched into the side of blocks, too. Oh, this is terrible. Or is that my shell? I don't even know. Oh, yeah. He's waiting to see if I back off, which I'm probably going to have to soon because my food is running low. Is that a goose? Is that an ostrich, too? There is. Okay, hold on. We're going to have to make a weapon here because I'm not allowed to use my good weapon to actually attack. Snail in a boat. Here we go. Don't underestimate me. Oh, he made a boat. Oh, you're not getting away from me. I have some advantages over Ryan. Look, he's in a boat. <laughs> Come on, Ryan, follow me. Get over here, dude. <laughs> dude, if I can catch him, this would be so funny. Shortest video ever. No, what did I get stuck on the fish? Where'd he go? He turned, he turned, he turned. Bro, you are not escaping me. I am a snail in a boat. This actually gives me more speed. He's behind me right now. I think the best thing I can do is get above. Oh my God. Oh, is he gonna get back on land? Oh, I'm slower on land. No. Oh, you're done. Oh, you're done. Come on, go, go, go. Go. Come on, go. Oh, no, climb. Come on. Oh no. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh my god. Oh. Go. No! No! Come on. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I lost him. <gasps> no, there he is. Is he under the water again? Oh, I need another boat. And I'm running low on food and it's almost night. <gasps> okay, he's he's gone for now. I'm gonna let him go for a sec, just so I can go ahead and get some food because oh my god, zombies. Duck, I need you to just die, please. On the bright side, I'm immortal, so I can just kind of take hits. Yeah, that's right. You can't you can't beat the invincible snail zombie. It's just it's not gonna work that way. Okay, perfect. Oh, having a good day? My goal, obviously, is to track down Unicorn uh, wherever he goes. But I'm going to give it a sec because, you know, I am a super smart immortal snail, right? So I got to make sure I'm using my smarticles, not just, you know, doing what I'm currently doing. What is this? Spider pit. I can already... I are, It's screaming spiders. Wow. Look at that. I'm not going down there. I'm not fearful of death, right? That's not the issue. I'm fearful because I need food. Oh, hey, some melons. Okay, heal up my food real quick. Catching him on foot's gonna be really difficult. You know what's not gonna be difficult? Catching him with ender pearls. So the goal is to get enough ender pearls to then sneak up on him and get him. Or that's the plan anyway. The thing is though, if he has a shield and he shields my hit, it doesn't count as a hit. So that's something I have to take into consideration here. Okay, cool. So it looks like the boats are here. I can actually take his boat. So let's go, let's take this boat and let's go explore a little bit back this way. I don't wanna go too far because I don't know where he's going. So we're gonna go back in the ocean this way a little bit. Cause I'm pretty sure I saw something back here. I think it was by this mountain right here. Yeah, look at that. Look at that right there. Boom. Is another dungeon? Do I even fit? I'm literally too fat. I don't fit. That is rude to the, all snails. Let's get mining this cobblestone. That's gonna let all the water in. I just realized that. Okay, I got all three cobblestone. I can now make a stone pickaxe. 
There we go. Okay, now we have this. So now we can just mine the floor down. Oh, there's still water down there. Do I fit at least? <laughs> no, I don't. Okay, we'll do it this way. We're gonna make a water staircase for my snail self. Okay, we got a bunch of mobs in here, but I can't die, so I'm not worried about it. Okay, the water is definitely gonna help here for a sec. Now, this is a big dungeon. Okay, there is loot. That's what I was looking for. Here we go. Climb this. What do we got in the chest? Oh, here we go. Okay, we broke it. Nice. Let's go down one of these staircases now. Oh my god, look at the mini-map. This is a dungeon and a half. Hopefully there's good loot down here. Oh my god. Oh, great. Here we go. There we go. Okay, get rid of your spawner. Okay, let's keep going through. Oh my god, there's a lot of chests in here. Pretty junky loot so far, if I'm being honest. It looks pretty bad so far. I'm gonna leave. I don't see this as being worthwhile. And I feel like there's a bunch of these. That didn't help as much as I was hoping it would. So we should probably get a food source though. I honestly kind of want to get out of this jungle. Let's just start moving our tracker in the direction that he's in. And then we'll just kind of go that way for now. Oh man, okay. I'm, I'm actually insanely stressed right now. He could come from anywhere. Ah, he could come from, what was that? Okay, we're probably pretty far from Unicorn at this point, which is fine. I kind of need nighttime to roll around. I should probably get some better weapons and stuff. What is this? Whoa, it's like a mega mushroom. That's cool. <gasps> no way there was something actually under there. That was a complete guess. That's so lucky. <gasps> An Enderman. Oh, we're killing him. We're so killing him. Yes, we got a pearl already. Let's go. We already got our first Ender Pearl. Hi, buddy. How are you today? Okay, let's get going. Ooh, is that another? I think I see a ruined nether portal. Oh, I do see a ruined nether portal. Let's go. Okay, we got a looting three gold sword. What are these running shoes? Increase movement speed and step height while sprinting. Oh, okay, hold up. How do I put these on? Like that? Do I have them on? Oh, I do feel faster. Oh, I think I'm faster now. Oh, that's so useful. Thank God. Okay, we're in a really good spot. I, I should honestly make my move. I have an ender pearl. I have running shoes. I mean, this is a good time to make a move. And he's actually getting closer to me because he was not in a straight line with me, but now he is. He's moving a lot, so he's got to be really close. No, he's still this way. Okay, interesting. We're gonna have to grab a boat. That's fine though. Honestly, I move faster as a boat and plus I look hilarious. Oh my God, I see him. He's right in front of me. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm okay. <gasps> oh my god! I'm not okay! <laughs> Come here. Oh! <laughs> the snail's coming for you, buddy! <laughs> oh, he's running. He's running. Oh, and he doesn't know I have the running shoes now. Oh my god, I might be able to catch him. I can't use the ender pearl here, though. I could try and do something fancy and ender pearl his boat, but I, I'm so afraid I'll miss. I don't want to lose him again. Come on. Okay, what would Dream do? What would Dream do in this situation, you think? That's right, you can't run from the super immortal, super smart, always can track you snail. Oh, maybe I can trap him here. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh, oh. He's not going for land, is he? Wait, what? Oh, he's going for land. I gotta use my enderpearl. Hold up, hold up, ready? Let's get ahead of him. Come on. Okay, okay, got some ground. <gasps> no! Oh! oh my god! Did you see him throw an ender pearl? <laughs> no! No! He saw it coming! No! I need a new boat. There we go. Go, go, go! And now I lost my ender pearl. No! Oh, that's so unfortunate. Oh, are you kidding me? Let's see if we can cut him off. Potentially, he thinks he lost me. I might be able to still get him here. I just don't know where he is. It says he's this way. I've completely lost him at this point. Okay, I, I think that's that. I think I've failed that chase. Right, right! Oh, it's a rat! Oh! <laughs> Hello, rat. <laughs> can, can we be friends? Wait, can we be friends? <gasps> no way! Oh my god, I got a rat friend! That's really unfortunate, too, because I was really excited for that one. Now, let's go see if we can just get some upgraded stuff. Now, we don't need armor, which is nice, but we definitely could use some swords and some better stuff. So, I think I need to actually grind out ender pearls for a little bit and see what I can go ahead and get. So, over the next eight days, I kept looking for ender pearls and collecting as many as I could. I did some other work during this time, too, but the main thing was the ender pearls. I was able to collect just under two stacks, and it was time to make my attack. Okay, so, as you can see, we officially have 30 ender pearls, which should be more than enough to finally catch a unicorn on whatever day we're on. I think we're on day 10. Yep, day 10. So let me just grab some food real quick. Oh, okay, here we go. Let's get out of here, shall we? Up, up, up. Okay, it says unicorn is this way. So we're gonna just start moving in the direction it tells us, to be honest with you. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's this? What am I looking at? Whoa, what is this? 
Arcane Glory. Checking it out. Oh! Oh, it's a fortress! Held up by bamboo. Hilarious. Right. <gasps> He's a little pancake! Yeah, what is this? Is this where he is? It looks like it. This is huge. This would be a perfect place to hide from a snail. Decaying glory. Yeah, I have no idea what this is. I thought maybe it was an end fortress for a sec. Okay, let's just keep going through. Take the iron. Oh my god, he is here. Look at look at the compass moved. He's here. He's literally here. Oh my god, I see him up there. Okay, where's my enderpearls? Where's my enderpearls? Where'd he go? I definitely just saw him. He's in the water. Here we go. Here we go. Ready? I gotta get it directly on him or he'll get me. Come on, get him. Come on, get him! Wait, what? What was that? Wait, what? Oh, oh no, I gotta go. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. I can get up there. No! Where'd he go? Oh no! That's dumb, that's dumb, I had him. Oh, oh my god, oh my god. Oh! No, I can't eat pro that, I can't eat pro that. I don't know where it's gonna land. He's going through here. No, I'm getting stuck on the bamboo. No, 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 no. Boat, get his boat, get his boat, get his boat. Come on! Get to that island. We're not losing him. Oh! Ah, tricky, tricky. Let me go over there. Come on, go, go, go. Can he just fling across all the... Oh, my God. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I see him, I see him. Oh, my God, this is ridiculous. I can't catch him. What is this slingshot thing? Oh, my God. No! Leave me! I'm out. I'm out. I, I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out. Come on. We got him. We got him. No, where is he? Oh, we have him. Come on. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I can't even see him. Oh, he's on a boat again. He's on a boat. Come on. Please hit this. Dang it. Oh my God. I'm so bad with ender pearls. Is that it? I only have 11 left. Oh God. Let's shoot his boat out. Oh my goodness, dude. Where's my boat? Where's my boat? We can catch him. I am not losing him here. Okay, he's going this way. We're going to stop here in ender pearl. Get to that land. Oh my god, I can never just make it to land, can I? Auto step, auto step, auto step. Move! We got him, we got him, we got him. Oh, the explosion just gave me a boost. Oh, you can't get up there. Is he gonna go up or down? Up or down, up or down, up or down. He's going up, he's going up. Oh, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, no! I got stuck in a tree! Where's the compass say? He's down there, I see him, I see him, I see him. At the village. Oh, let's go, we're right behind him. He doesn't even notice, doesn't even notice. Come on, get him! Spider, move! Oh, we have him. He's up here. Go! Go! We're stuck in the tree! Dude, these stupid leaves. I keep just getting stuck in the tree so my swings don't hit him. That would have been a hit. I see him up on the tree. Let's get up here on this tree. Then we can get over here and get him on this tree. Where's he going? That tree? Oh, I don't know if I can hit this. I can hit that, though. I can hit that, though. No, I can't! No, I can't! Oh, I'm so bad. Hold on, can I? Please hit this. Did I get it? Oh! Hey, guess what? I can kill him. No! No! I Come on, that was a prank! Come on, we have him! Dude, I'm mad. I should have just killed him. I got arrogant. I got arrogant. Did he cross the ocean already? How? Oh, I see he's in a boat. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that was stupid on my part. I should have just killed him. I wanted a cool, interesting ending. So I was like, sneak up behind him, bow him, troll him a little bit, then kill him. Would be more interesting, and it backfired. Next time, he's just dying. No more Mr. Nice Snail. I'm actually really upset at that. Uh, but I'm out of Ender Pearl, so we need to come up with a new plan. It turns out I'm terrible with them. I'm absolutely terrible with them. I, and here I am thinking I'm okay with Ender Pearls. Like, oh, they're easy. Just throw them. I whiffed probably half of those throws. Okay, so what am I going to do next? Let's come up with another game plan. Instead of doing Ender Pearls, maybe we can set some sort of trap that unicorn can fall for and then if we trap him we can get like a pitfall trap or something we can kill him but we need to get ahead of him so if he's heading in this direction we would need to get ahead of where he's going and put something that looks natural ahead of me so he steps into it so we got to get ahead of his movement patterns and see if we can get him to fall into a pitfall trap or or some trap of some kind because clearly ender pearls are not my thing and that's not gonna work so we're gonna try a trap instead so i'm gonna take a few days i think i'm gonna just spend the next little bit gathering supplies to build in this trap then then worry about getting ahead of his location, then setting the trap, and then seeing if we can get him to fall for it. Uh, we need something that's simple, so I'm actually going to take a quick pause and <laughs> do some research on traps, because I actually know very little on Minecraft traps, but I definitely need to learn some if I'm going to trap him here. So I'm going to quickly look up some pitfall traps and see what I can come up with. Okay, I got a really basic one that I really just need TNT for. I need to find some TNT, because ain't nobody got time to make TNT. So we're going to see if we can find some real quick, and if we, if we can't, then we'll obviously have to make it. But for now, we're going to try and find some TNT, because if we can find TNT, we can make a very simple trap. And that very simple trap should be good enough to trap Unicorn Man and get him burned to death. Or that's the goal anyway. Let's find out if it works. What did I just stumble across? Hi, Dire Wolf. Hello. Are we friends? They don't want to murder me. Cool. Well, I'm just going to let you go. I'm just going to let you go. It says he's this way. Unicorn very well could be mining. 
Oh my god, I see him. Should eat some food. Move up, move up, move up. Oh my god. <laughs> I see him. Oh, I have to leave it. Oh, I'm out of here. He, did he hear me? Oh, he heard me. He heard me. Hello! Come here, you! Oh, I got it. What is it? What did I take? A gun table. He was trying to make a gun? No guns for you, sir. Thank you for the free gun table, though. He was trying to make a gun. Look at this. Oh, my God. And I just took it away from him. You can't make guns if I take your gun thing. He got my gun table. Okay, I got his gun table. Now, where'd he go? His thing's pointing this way. <gasps> what is that? A crystal iron golem? Whoa. Okay, where'd the unicorn go? He's in this house. <laughs> no! Dude, that's not cool. I don't fit. I don't fit. He broke at the back. Yep. Oh, he's, he's trying to grapple. He's trying to grapple. It's not working, though. Let me get him. Let me get him. Let me kill him. He's so close. He's so... Oh, my God. No, I'm stuck again. Dude, I, I'm, I, I get within, like, a five or six blocks. I need one more block, and I can get the hit off. He's really struggling to run now that I have speed, and he does not have a boat on him right, right now. I can tell. He would have boated already. Oh, this could be a dead end for him. We'll go over. Oh, no, he grappled. No, he's doing... He led me to a peninsula on purpose because I'm boatless. Dang you. Okay, he got away. That's fine. We want to go find redstone anyway. Um, Looks like he was doing some mining in and around this area, so I'm probably going to also do the same. Do some mining here real quick. Here we go. A cave system. Perfect. Whee! Okay, let's go get some redstone real quick. Okay, we'll go down this way. Oh, this is pretty far. This has got to be low enough. Oh, hold up. What is this? We got ourselves a spawner. Oh, I'm going to break the skeleton spawner real quick. What? There you go. You're dead. Oh, another golden apples. Aqua affinity. Don't really care. No, nothing really good. Well, that's this. This ended up being kind of a bust. I thought I found something cool. I need redstone. Is this redstone or is this rubies? Oh, that's ruby. Okay, that's got to be redstone, right? Redstone. Okay, yep, that is redstone. Okay, this should be enough. Yep, that gives me 23 redstone. Okie dokie. So we're at another desert. Will this one contain a temple? Let's find out. On spending two weeks looking for TNT, the right move would have been crafting it, but I didn't do that. Oh, we actually found a temple. Hold up. What day are we on? 24. It only took, I think since day 11, I've been looking. So that's what, 13 days of just looking for a temple. We found one. Just need the 19 T. It's all I need. Okay. We got to be very careful going down here because obviously as a snail, I'm a little bit wider so I can step on that pressure plate way easier. So I'm actually going to come down on this corner here. Okay. Can't set it off anymore. We're good. There we go. We got the TNT. Nice. A proto armor. I don't know what that is, but that sounds like some sort of cool mech thing. I'll take it. And there we go. Let's try this mechanics mech thing real quick. Mech, what are you doing? Oh. <laughs> it looks so stupid. Oh, I love it. What does it need to move? I don't even know how this works. Oh, here we go. Looks like I need power sources and all this fancy schmancy stuff that I have absolutely no idea what it does. So, uh, Mr. Mech, you can stay there. I gotta go build a trap. And I... D how far am I? Oh, God! I'm like 5,000 blocks away from where we started. And the unicorn, I think, has gotta be at least 1,000 away. We have a hefty run ahead of us our compass is pointing this way so we're obviously gonna go this way and off we go i have been legit boating for days now and i'm still i'm still not even close landing and oh oh wait i just used the cheating sword i didn't mean to okay i won't use the cheating sword this time let go of me stop it anymore okay we're good oh that was terrifying i did not see that coming at all Oh, we've got to be getting close. Maybe he's in the water. That'll make my life easier, to be honest. Grab my boat back. Get rid of these iron bars I don't need. Unicorn's got to be pretty far at this point. No matter what I do, I cannot seem to get close. I keep going straight, though, until I find him, because I'm going to eventually find him, and I am going to build that trap. Okay, so we're still traveling. It's been like an entire day since then. Uh, day 28 has just started, and we have stumbled across a village, which I'm totally cool with. Okay, we found a village, which could mean unicorns nearby. It says unicorns this way. He might be in this snow biome. But we'll have to get north of him somehow. Oh, that's him right there, I think, running straight ahead. I think I see him. Yeah, he's underground. He's underground. Okay, I'm gonna hold shift. Okay, I'm gonna build the trap. I'm gonna build the trap. Here we go. Ready? I lost his nameplate. Is he on the move again? No, no, he's not. He's not. He's not. Hello. Hello. He didn't see me, but he, well, he would have any second. Come here. A moose is oh, oh my god Oh my god No I gotta check this sled real quick check this sled check this sled can I get in it No I don't wanna get in it like that No I don't wanna explode it Oh he's grappling up that hill Is he dancing? You know you just don't have a care in the world until the snail shows up. 
probably shouldn't have done that. I probably should not have done that. Well, he has no clue what he's gotten. I got in store for him then. I'm not even going to waste my time climbing. He's just going to cross. Yep. See, I knew what he was going to do. Oh, you could be in trouble here. Ryan predicted it. Oh, we're making ground. We're making ground. Come on. Come on. Stop getting stuck in the bushes. I want to get north of him though. Okay, we're going into a cool forest. We'll pretend we lose him. Okay. I see him up on a tree over there. I'm just going to pretend I don't. Okay, let's try and build the trap here because it looks like he's not running. There must be something in this area that he wants. Dig out this area. Okay, now the bottom layer we want to fill with TNT. So let's go ahead and put, put our TNT down. Now we're going to place redstone down. And now we got to place sand on top of this redstone. So I'm going to put sand on top and then chest on top. We'll do... And now we're just going to fill in the edges so it looks a little bit more natural here. There we go. And then we're just going to put a trap chest in the center. Of that. How do we make a trap chest? Let's see. Tripwire hook. How do we make a tripwire hook? Iron stick wood. Easy. Iron stick wood. Okay, that makes us our tripwire hooks. Combine the chest with this. We get an acacia trap chest. Now, if that is opened, it should pitfall them in there when they step on it. Here we go. The trap is set. So we got to position ourselves close by and hidden. So let me put myself somewhere where I can quickly get up and make it not all conspicuous. So I have to get in these trees somehow. So let me here and here. Break that. Please go in the water. Okay, it dropped below the edge. That's good enough. Yeah, it dropped below the edge. Good enough. Okay, cool. We're going to hide right back here. That Bruh. is not very hidden, but I think with the pink tree, we should be fine. Okay, now we should see where he is. He's still in that straight direction. Oh my God, I could chase him into it. Hold on. Let's see if we can get around and chase him into it. That would work really well. I think I saw his nameplate underground. I just, I'll confirm in a sec. This is over here. Yeah, yeah, there's his name right there. Oh, hello. Oh, no spider move. Oh, that's cheating. I can't use that penalty. One, two, three. Can't use the OP sword on mobs. That's cheating. Oh, and he's going the wrong way. We got to cut him off. Here we go. We're going to cut him off. Ready? We're going to get in front of him this way. There we go. We got him. We got him. Nice. We got him. Turn around. Nice. He's going back in the right direction right now. Please work. Oh my God. If this actually works, if he sees the chest, he might grab it and fall in it real quick. He's sideways. He's sideways. I saw the explosion. He's over here. I see him. I see him. He's running. We got a boat, though. Where'd he go? He's going over there. He's going over there. Yes! That's the right direction. Go, 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 go. I gotta hurry. If I'm not in time, I won't make it. No, he's running. He's running. He's running. Oh, my God. That's literally the island, I think. I think that's the island. No, he walked right by it. Did he see it? Did he see it? I don't even know if he saw it. Maybe he saw it. Oh, it might not be obvious enough. He's this way. I'm so mad that pitfall trap didn't work. We got to cut him off again. We got to keep just leading him back this way. Oh, no. He's, he's already turning around, actually. This works out. Oh, this works out. Yes. Yes. Cut him off. We'll cut him off to the left. So he has to go back to the island. Got to go back to the island. You got to go back to the island. Exactly, my friend. Please fall for it. He fell. Did it not pitfall him? It didn't pitfall him. No. What? What? My pitfall didn't even work. Duh. I'm so mad. Why did that not work? I watched a tutorial and everything where it worked. People who are good at redstone in the comments probably like flaring up right now. So mad I messed that up. Come on, we can still get him. We can still get him. We still got him. We're so close. We're so close. Let's go. Let's go. Or he's right there. He's right there. What are you going to do? Grapple? Okay, there we go. Go to this one. To this tree. To this tree. To this tree. To that one. Oh, you can't run. You can't run. Go, snail, go! Oh, I can't make that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, I can actually. Hold up. Oh, we actually made that. Oh, wow. Oh, he's done. He's done. He's done. He's done. Never mind. Nope. That's a grapple across the ocean. <laughs> ah, dang it. We need a new plan. And you know what? I have a plan, but it's going to take a minute to set up. Hear me out. What if we got Elytra? We still got over 70 days remaining, and that would guarantee me an easy way to kill him. But it's going to take a bit of setup. So let's go. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go to the Ender Dragon, defeat the Ender Dragon, and do all that jazz. We're invincible, so we might as well, right? Go fight the Ender Dragon, bet him to death, then go ahead and get ourselves a pair of Elytra, and that should be good enough. Let's let's do all that. We're going to give him a break, give him a sec to do his thing, and I'm going to go work on getting the Ender Dragon. Okay, well, the first step to going to the end is very simple. One, man, I hope this rain stops. But two, the first step is nice and easy. It is get to the nether, because we need to get some supplies there if we're going to be okay. So let's make our way to the nether, which obviously to do that, we're going to need a water bucket and all that, so we can go ahead and get our way to the nether. Okay, so I found a lava pool, and I found some water near it. So this is where I'm going to start setting up my nether stuff. Took me a few days to get here. We are currently on day 33. First things first though, let's find a quick cave, grab ourselves some iron clumps and get those smelted up so we can actually get our way to the nether. Here we go. Wow. You know what? It'll do. Oh, I dug into another cave. Look at that. Oh, hi. There we go. There's some iron. Okay, that gives us five. We need six. And there, that gives us nine. So that's an extra pickaxe there too. So we'll grab that. So let's head back up. Okay, here's the lava pool. Let's go ahead. Let's melt up this iron and smelt the iron. Okay, we need to find a stretch of four in a row. Aha, that's what I wanted. Yeah, there we go. That gives us our bottom. Now we're going to take this, fill it with lava, break that, boink, boink. 
Ready? We're going to put lava down, then water down. Really fast. Ready? Lava, water. Oh, no. Oh, we still got some lava left. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Grab another lava bucket. That should work. Okay, it did. Lava there. Yeah. And then we just need grab this water. Put that water there. Grab this lava. Put that lava there. Boom. Okay, we got ourselves our, our table. Now we can finally go to the nether and continue this long process. So I got my nether portal working on day 33. And now I just needed to find a bastion so I could get gold and trade it with hoglins. Which turned out to be way harder than I thought. Okie dokie. So, so far, still getting stuck and still no Bastion. I've been looking for a bit now. I don't even know how long it's been. It's been, God, it's been days. I thought it's been maybe a couple, but it's been like a good bit of days and there's still no Bastion anywhere. Is that one? Hold up. Is that a Bastion? I thought they were more, I thought they had like skull entrances. If it is, I sure don't know what this Bastion is. Yeah, it's a Bastion. Look at that. Let's see, they're all going to murder me if I go in there without gold on. So I'm going to take this block, quickly do this, and just make myself a golden helmet. That way they just don't murder me on sight and they should leave me alone for having gold on. Now I just need to actually trade them for gold. And I can't mine their gold because they'll attack me then too. So a lot of people know where the gold blocks spawn in these things. I'll be honest with you. I don't. I don't know where anything spawns in this thing. I just just need to find it. So, okay, there we go. He's dead. Okay, there should be gold blocks in here that I can steal and trade with them. And I just need to get ender pearls. So let's go up here. Oh, here we go. A lot of chests. Oh, a lot of gold. Here we go. Now we're talking. That's fine. Let me just quickly make him a hole. Hit me all you want, friend. Oh, he put me in the hole. Will you come in here too? Uh oh. Okay, let's break this block. We got a few trapped in there. Nice. We got one trapped, two trapped. Okay, I'll just kill you. Nice. Okay, cool. We got you guys who are willing to trade. Oh, yeah. We easily have enough to get back now. Okay, cool. Let's go on back. Hello, friends. Hello, all of you who are trapped in this hole. Well, I need you all to trade me for the remaining gold I have and see if that gives me enough ender pearls. It'd be really great if it did. Any ender pearls, though? No, give me ender pearls, friends. Come on. Oh, yeah, there we go. I saw Ender Pearls. Oh, that's 20. That is way more than enough. Oh, we are set. Thank you, whoever just gave me like four Ender Pearls. Yes. There we go. We have enough. Now we just need to get some blaze rods, turn them into eyes, get to the end, defeat the dragon. And then it's probably going to be like day 50 by that time or day 60 by that time. And then it's time to make our attack and get those everything we need. Oh my God. What an attack. Okay. Well, we got what we need. So let's make our way back. We I've lost. I, I didn't keep track of where my original nether portal was. So because of that, I could go back and do and find my original nether portal and that original nether fortress. However, I have a gut feeling I'm going to find one faster, not trying to look for that because I don't know where to go. I feel like it's going to be faster just to look for a new one. So that's what I am going to do. <gasps> there we go. Is this the original one I was at? I don't think so. I think there was soul sand there. So no, I don't remember a destroyed portal. Hold up. Let's check this out. We can actually probably repair our nether portal here. Oh, yeah, look at that. Throw that on. Booyah. Now we just need to get up here and see. Oh, yeah, there's blazes. I don't know if there's a blaze spawner, but there's definitely blazes. Nice. There we go. No blaze rod yet. Come on, we guess we got one. There we go. Okay, we just need two to three more of these things and we're good. So just a doink. Okay, you're dead. There we go. That's one. That gives us eight. I want to get ten just to be safe. Okay, that didn't drop one. Come on. Dang it. Please drop one. No, we went right into the lava. Nice. We got it. That's 10. That's 10 right there. Nice. We got it. Okay, let's go make our way back to the overworld really quick. Let's just uh, pop this bad boy to a nice one, two, three, one, two, one, two. Three, flint, steel, bada bing, bada boom, I'm gone. Out of the nether we go. <gasps> and we're free. I have no idea where we are. Let's check our map. Got you. So um, we are here. Everywhere that's been generated is all the way over here. We have a long while to walk. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make my way back towards one of our normal spawn areas, then make my way to the Ender Dragon, then go from there. So I'm probably about a four or five day journey just from the spawn lands we were at. So I'm going to make my way back there, then I'm going to go for the Ender Dragon, then we'll go from there. So cool. Okay, so we are back in the main area here, back where we built our original nether portal. It's somewhere around here. I can't actually find the portal. It's in this forest somewhere. I know it is. So let's go ahead. Let's get the Ender Pearls and the Blaze Rods combined. So we'll turn these into the Blaze powder just to test this out we combine that with these perfect and we have the eyes of ender now we're gonna go and throw them and test them out go this way what i lost it already i genuinely have no clue which direction that went in okay there we go we got this one back 
Okay, cool. So we got to go in this direction for a little bit. So we're going to head in this direction and we'll just keep testing the eyes as we get closer and find out where this, this, this end fortress is. With uh, 50 days remaining, we really got to try and kill him now because we're in the back end of the 50. We're about to get hopefully Elytra within the next 10 to 20 days would be my estimate. Get the Elytra, use the Elytra to catch him. If we can get a rocket, that would be prime too. Use all that to kill him and that will win us the game. But obviously that is way easier said than done because, uh, well, he has that grapple. So makes it a little bit challenging, but we're going to try. Okay, we'll go this way. We are currently at negative 200 something. Here, let's go throw our thing, see where it's going. Still in this direction. Cool. Okay, we got our portal back, or our thing back. What? Did it go down? Oh, it did. It went down. It went down. Hold on. That's going down. Yep, 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 yep. We finally get down. We're here. We don't have beds to beat the Ender Dragon, I know, but that's fine. I'm not worried about it. Here we go. We're here. And we are in. Oh, this is cool. Look at the dragons. What? This is so sick. Oh, there's the portal. Oh, no, that's just a spawner. Oh, no, there's the portal. I actually see it this time. Hey, hold the phone. We need more blaze powder. Combine it with all our ender pearls. There we go. Now we'll go ahead and put these in place. <gasps> no! Oh, wait, I can't die in lava. Right. I was nervous for a sec, but I forgot I can't die. Okay, no going back now. This is going to be very difficult, but we're going to do it. Oh my god, I thought I was falling out of the world for a second there, and I got really scared. Okay, well, it didn't put me where I wanted. I probably should have saved some ender pearls. We got some blocks we can work with to get over there, so that's fine. Please don't kill me, Mr. Dragon. Oh, that's not fair. No, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh my god, he could have killed us there. He literally could have killed us there. Hold up. <gasps> yes, there we go. And we are up. Let's not anger any endermen, not that it truly matters. Here we go, up we go. And we're up. And we're immortal, so we can just go bangity bang bang, and we're good. Now we just need to get to all the other ones and destroy them. And another one destroyed. Yeah, this is gonna be a little bit easier, huh? Nice. Nice, we sniped that one. Nicely done, let's get down into the water again. Get on this smaller one here. There we go. Nice, and we got it. Can we get this one? Dude, yes, let's go. We only have two more to do. Let's get to this one first. There we go. Get up here. Throw it to the top here. There we go. Is that all of them? Double check. That is all of them. There is no more healing for this dragon. There he is. He's in the center now. And now let's take him out. We just got to kill the dragon. Oh, that was brutal. Come here. Land in the center already, would you? He has all this bedrock, I think, to make it harder to get him. Okay, I'm officially out. Really wish this middle area wasn't covered. Let this dragon come into us and we can get a kill on it. Come on. Oh, we got him. Yes, there we go. Okay, dragon's dead. Not that the actual boss fight matters. Kill it with the OP broken sword. That's fine. Doesn't actually matter all that much. And I don't need any of his items, so me killing him with the cheese sword doesn't matter. The only thing I really needed from this dragon was the ability to go further into the end. So now that he's dead, there should be a place I can ender pearl into. Oh, there it is. Okay, I see the thing I got to go to. Okay, it's all the way over here. Now, I'm not going to obviously risk ender pearl into that. We're going to build over that bad boy. Uh, we are going to build ourselves a little way to do it. We should be able, theoretically, to get Elytra, which should help us kill a unicorn and end this video off once and for all. So let's grab our seven dirt. We're close. Really close. There we are. Oh my god, an end ship already? No way did I just find Elytra. Oh no, this is the better end mod. So this, the, these don't spawn with Elytra. We got to actually find an end fortress. I'm going to screenshot these coordinates so I know how to get back because getting back is going to be hard otherwise. So let's just screenshot this. So it took about three days of traveling around the better end to actually locate a fortress with Elytra. I passed by a few that had no Elytra, but obviously they're useless. So I skipped them and moved on. But luckily for me, shortly after all of this, I found one that I was looking for. Okay, cool. We found one. Is this it? It's just a tower? There's no, well, there's no boat, so there's no elytra here. That actually really stinks. Come on, give me levitation. Exactly. Come on, friends. Everyone shoot me. Ta-da! We made it. Okay, cool. What do we get? Oh, hello, Poppy. Okay, we got ourselves a much better sword to fight things with. We got ourselves another much better iron pickaxe. Got ourselves some nice boots. Not that they matter. Uh, we got diamonds again. Not that they really matter all that much. 
but we got them. So, well, we got the stuff we needed from here, so let's just break out and let's keep going. And we're out of here. Let's go find another one, shall we? Oh, we got another one right there. Please have a ship. <gasps> ship! Ship, 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 Okay, it does have a ship. Yep, there we go. Nine more seconds of levitation. Let's get up on this, this bridge here. Down here we go. Elytra, there we go. Okay, let's fly back to the coordinates. Let's head back and we can get Unicorn Man and win this. Yeah, we're a flying snail. Look at that. Yeah, this looks so stupid. I love it. Why did this end city? No, this, I don't remember this end city. Wait, am I going the wrong way? This one has a ship too. <gasps> we could get a second pair of Elytra. No, 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 I'm not gonna worry about that. Let's just worry about getting back for now and then we'll go from there. Okay, boop, scoop, and let's get out of here, shall we? Cool, we're back at the end. Here we go. We have some hunting to do. We are back at zero, zero. And if we can find him, we can get him. Right, snail friend? Okay, now we just gotta hunt him down wherever he is. This is probably gonna take quite a few days to actually get to Unicorn to murder him. But now that we have the Elytra, in fact, I'm gonna even risk them so they don't get damaged. I'm gonna take them off. We're gonna keep them in our inventory. But when we see him, we can fly to him, murder him, and this challenge is over. He's gonna be really far in this... Okay, hold up. I have this opportunity. I can't, I can't say no to this. Is this a complete waste? Yes. Am I doing it anyway? Also, yes. Okay, maybe there is nothing in here. Maybe I'm just mining into nothingness. Yeah, maybe. Okay, you know what? On second thought, if there's something in there, you'll live another day. That would take so long to mine through all that stuff. And there we go. We're on the move. Let's get Unicorn Man. Let's hunt him down. Hold up, hold up, hold up. This might get us closer. We can teleport to one of the old villages. It only takes a level to do it. This probably just got us closer to him. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, we're pretty fast right now. I think we might even be faster than a normal player. Okay, there we go. All my slownesses are back. We just. I just realized they were gone. Went and talked to our administrator. We got him back. We're good. What were we doing again? Right, locating Unicorn. Well, that gave me even more of a head start because I had to fix that. What day are we even on? Did that even advance the day? Okay, no, it didn't. We're still on 66. Good. Okay, is he in this village? Oh, no, it's a <gasps> it is him. Oh, my God, it's him. Does he see me? Yeah, he sees me. He sees me. He's running. He's running. He had to have teleported. I legit have no idea where he went. There's a village up here that's pointing out. I bet you we went here. No, it's angling him more to the left. Oh, my God, where did he go? What did he do? I don't even know how he did that. I see him. Oh, my God, I see him. Yeah, I see him. Here we go. Ready? He's enderpearling. That's what he did before he enderpearled. I got him! Oh, I got him! Oh! <laughs> Thank goodness! I don't even know how you disappeared the first time I was chasing you. Oh, I, I crafted a wand and I, I learned a teleport spell. <laughs> oh my god, I was like, where did he go? What happened? <laughs> And then I was like, I can't let him disappear again because I'll just lose him. So I had to dive bomb your ender pearl. Oh, it worked. The flying snail won it. Uh, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you've ever wondered about this hypothetical, the answer is the snail will win. You can't win. It's a snail. Thanks for watching and goodbye.